To construct a square given AB, we need to start by extending the line. Then we're going to get our compass, and then we're going to be building equidistance arcs around A. So here's my arc on A, and now let me give the same distance to the left. And now by doing that, I'm going to be placing my metal leg on the intersection. I'm going to open it up more than a half, and I'm going to be creating a mark on the top, and I'm going to be creating a mark on the bottom. Let's do the same with the other intersection. Mark on the top, mark on the bottom. Now let's connect those intersections. Now that the intersection has been connected, essentially what we have done, we have done a perpendicular bisector, so we have created 90 degrees at these intersections. Let's repeat the process for now at point B. And the last step that we need to do, we need to make sure that every single side has the same length. So let's find the length for AB. The length for AB was this much. Let's give it that length on the top. And also, let's give it a length of the top of the other line. Now that intersections have been connected, we have created a square. This figure that we see here, highlighted in yellow, now can be considered a square, given one of the sides being AB.